So these guys are uh, Laporte Canada at Six, um, the Canada Stinging Nettle. Um, it uh, has tiny little stinging hairs on it, which is why we're wearing gloves. And um, it commonly grows in uh, sort of open woods, in rich soils, um, moist soil. And uh, right now we are just transferring these guys. They've grown in tissue culture and we are outplanting them for the first time to uh, see if we can uh, get some healthy, vigorous plants. Those are what contains the chemical that is um, So we have to be careful, obviously, um, feeling wearing belt gloves too. The general rule is when you're transplanting something that you should be able to sweep a little bit of water out of the soil. So just wet it right in the tray. My favorite part of our job. Getting my hands dirty. Completely sterile so we run it through the autoclave. At a really high temperature, just to kill anything that is in the soil. Bring it to the top and kind of pack it down a little bit. Think about how a native plant is in the wild. It's got uh, a natural soil, right? It doesn't have um, any additional nitrogen in it. So um, that's what we're playing around with here, trying to find the right mix. This here that I have is a pro mix that uh, we have added a little extra perlite to and uh, extra sand. Uh, this one is a pro mix that we've added just perlite to. Uh, to see the difference. A lot of the time with native plants, we discover that um, they really don't need a, a rich potting soil. So you're going to be taking plant out with forceps, using the other smaller forceps, just gently remove any of this debris. You know that any of that um, is just going to rot and we're just going to get fungal problems straight off. So moving that, if you can get in there that little piece there as well. Um, you're just going to dip that in the deionized water to get rid of any extra agar. And then I'm going to make a hole here. Pass it on over. So we've transplanted our first tray here. They're going to go out into the phytotron now. Some warm, moist conditions. 